This clip is in response to a student's question in our group chat about the notion of how if he goes through my high yield free PDFs, which I've repeatedly discussed, I derive my material from the NBME exams, okay, and my nine plus years of tutoring. I've talked about how the NBME exams and the USMLE are exactly the same thing. The questions are repeated. That his concern regarding if he goes through my high yield PDFs prior to the NBME exams, will his scores be artificially inflated on the NBMEs and therefore, OMG, he shouldn't do my PDFs prior to the NBMEs, he should do them after, question mark, okay? And it's not just the student isolation. I've seen it on prior YouTube comments on my clips. Uh, students have raised that concern. Uh, I've been forwarded a comment from Reddit from a student. Okay, that's a, that's a discussion in of itself, how students obsess over Reddit and forward me info. However, this notion of your scores artificially being inflated on the USMLE is absolute nonsense. There is no such thing as artificial score inflation on the NBME exams. And that will get some students heated, okay? You say, well, if you're telling me, you know, direct answers from the NBMEs, look, if you're studying the correct fucking material, your scores are going to go up. Students sometimes would literally prefer, I'm not joking, you will get some people who literally prefer to study resources, e.g. Kaplan notes, that have no fucking relation to the NBME slash USMLE material, score lower on the NBMEs, and then yet they're somehow content with that because their scores aren't inflated. If you are studying the right material, your scores will go up on the NBME exams. Where do you think QBanks derive their ideas from? Okay? You think you will just, you think like the writers of these questions just sit in a room at 3 a.m. and they're like, hmm, this might be a good idea for a question. Maybe they do, but they're not fucking stupid. They look at the NBME material, okay? And then it's not an accident that when you go through UWorld, you're going to score better on the NBME exams, but people aren't worrying about UWorld artificially inflating their scores, are they? So if you're going through the correct material, your scores will be higher on the NBME exams. My PDFs cut to the fucking chase. They're not superfluous like first aid. They're actually very targeted for the NBME exams. At the end of the day, you have to ask yourself what your goal is, okay? You need to distance yourself from this notion of inflation versus non-inflation. It's meaningless. If you score higher on the NBMEs, You've learned the material you're supposed to learn, and then you're going to score higher on the real USMLE because the content is repeated, okay? So if you learn something from my PDFs, you score higher on the NBME, you will score higher on the USMLE, okay? I address this question because I've seen it repeatedly, okay? And I'll probably make future clips on this. In fact, I know I will have to make future clips on this. You know the deal. I'm going to continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.